It's a simple childhood pleasure, but riding a bike is out of reach for many children with a disability. Now a team of Tasmanian volunteers is trying to change that. Jack Duffy became Kayak Jack when his father Chris paddled from Hobart to Launceston for charity two years ago. The five-year-old is familiar with water. Now for the first time he's ridden a bike. He hasn't had the freedom of movement and, uh, and really the ability to zip around like this, so it's a great opportunity. Freedom Wheels is a national program run by volunteers. So far they've built 30 bikes that are modified for Tasmanian children with a disability. Sometimes they can't keep their hands on the handlebars and we've got to work around for that. And sometimes they need some support up the back and we've got a really cool high riser that we put up the back and we can clip anything onto that high riser that they need. Each custom-built bike costs at least $600. They're sponsored by businesses and community groups. Nice work, Mr Jack. Good boy. Whoa, yeah. whoa, whoa, look at nice you. Nice work. <laughs> Jack will get his new wheels in three months. For Alexander Wiley, the wait is over. That's the smile. That's what we came for. <laughs> Apart from the thrill of the ride, there are therapeutic benefits. That the actual movement through space is fairly critical for children to, to experience. The fact that they have to maintain head and trunk control over bumps. I'm towing them around and all of a sudden I'm not working as hard. They're starting to pedal. It's an amazing feeling. As more children are referred to the program each year, it's hoped new sponsors will keep the wheels turning. Emily Bryan, ABC News, Launceston.